What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We're doing a Strix. It is our first Strixhaven draft. Strixhaven. And the dogs are going crazy right now. So that's good. That's good. Strix it up. Oh, what up, my my Fritzy? What is this? Why is why am I the only one ready here? <laughs> Did the client crash? Is it going down? Oh, all right, cool, 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 cool. Uh, no, I want to bigify it. Infuriate is our mystical archive. Not, not great. Three damage to any target and learn. That's very good. This guy is banging. Five four trample, and you get to learn when he comes into play. Sure, let's do that. <laughs> She does. She does love learning. Return a permanent to his owner's hand, then return a permanent from your graveyard to your hand. That's good, too. I'm just going to go with the Gnarled Professor. <clears throat> Igneous Inspiration, also very, very good. Sign in Blood. These look great. <laughs> really, really thrilled for these. Uh, Fervent Master, you may pay four instead of paying five. <laughs> Good deal. Yeah, it's just like a glorified gamble. Oh, four for two, you can gain a life, you can learn. Pest Summoning makes two gentlemen. Might not be bad because we do have a learner card already. Whenever you cast an instant or sorcery that targets only this, you may pay two if you copy that spell. Don't care about that. I am going to reserve this guy for now. Plus two, negative two is pretty good. It's basically uh, cheaper... What's that card called? Exile tapped creature at instant speed. That's pretty good. Expel seems good. Yeah, I think Expel does seem good. Two two for two. Whenever you cast a coming instant, it's something now. We're not doing that. Um, I kind of like. I mean, I just like. I spatial. No, not spatial contortion. The other one. Um, the nameless inversion. That's the one I'm thinking of. Stone rain. Containment breach. Another lesson. Destroy an artifact or enchantment if its main value is two or less. Create a pest. It's actually pretty good. I don't know how how high to value. Uh, lessons. When this hunter is about, it's a 4-3 for 4 that makes a pest. That's actually pretty good. Typically for 4 mana, you're making 3-3s three that make 1-1s. One this is a 4-3 that makes a 1-1 one one that actually does something, which is just a a very high... Uh, this is just an improvement. Scry to then draw. And are you cast or copy an instant open 1 and counter on this? 3 mana for a 2-2 two -two that gets counters every time you cast the spell is pretty good. Draw 2 and you put a land from your hand on the battlefield for 4. That's actually really good. I kind of like that a lot. Um, I'm actually going to take this. Memory Lapse. I kind of like Memory Lapse. Look at that neck. Look at that long neck. Uh, choose one. It deals five damage to a flyer or destroy an artifact. Okay, so we've seen this before. Search library for a forest, put it on the battlefield, then learn. Not bad. Fractal summoning, create a zero zero, put X one one counters on it. Quandrix is kind of nutty. What is the, the you mean the you mean the school? First draft, you go. I mean, wow, that's actually that's actually kind of funny. Uh I kind of just want memory lapse here. Yeah, I'm gonna take memory lapse. Oh, what do we got here? Quandrix Cultivator. Three, four, four, four. Oh, this is the one you can search your library for a forest or an island. That guy seems great. Two, five, four, four. You add one man of any color or an X mana where X is the amount of life you gain this turn. So I kind of like this better. <laughs> like this is a three, four. This is a two, five. They both cost the same, but this guy's always getting you a mana forever. Uh... Yeah, I think it's the Cultivator. That guy seems great. Emergent sequence. Search your library for basic land card. This is the one where the land actually becomes a thing. 
That land becomes zero, zero. So I don't like this because like you search for a land and then they just kill it. But I guess it's just a one for one at that point. Tap, this is this guy seems great. Two two for two two flyer for three. It's just an upgraded frost links. And then we also have the campus. I'm gonna take the frost links. What is this? Oh, this is the uh this is the 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 rare land in the cycle. Thank you. Needlethorn Drake. Oh, RPG Badgerus. Thank you for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. Garbage Andy, what up? Good to see you. Um, two, four for three. Okay, you're not exciting. It's either the Neilthorn Drake or this fixing land. I kind of like the fixing land. <sighs> actually, this is pretty good, right? I actually don't know. I, I mean, like, we have a lot of, like, double, 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 double. I'm going to take the fixing land. Duress. Ooh, that's a good looking duress. Curate. Look at the top two cards. Put any number of them in your graveyard. So this is actually, isn't this just surveil? Isn't this just surveil too? What am I missing? 2-2 two, two for 2 with reach. It gets plus 2, plus 2 as long as you control 8 or more lands. That's actually not bad. Create a 0-0 zero, zero where X is the number of lands you control. Badger, we're doing all right. How are you doing, buddy? I'm going to take this. What is the beeping? Okay. Just checking. Oh, Aether Helix. This came back. Bouncing a thing and then returning any card from your graveyard seems pretty decent. That's sizable tempo. What is Resculpt? X start. Oh, yeah, okay, the 4-4. Four, four. Sure. It's a bomb. What's a bomb? I don't know what a bomb is. Oh, in the house. Got it. The beeping. <laughs> no, <laughs> Katie's doing something. I'm like, what is this noise? Oh. Oh, that is cute. Isn't that that cute? is cute. But I just wanted to do it with That's cute, yeah. Looking good. Looking good, babe. Thanks, babe. Do you want to see this picture my dad sent with of Louie's new house? Yeah. Oh my god, <laughs> wow. This is so cute. Look at him. Can you trust me? Okay. Get this Hold on, let me uh Ding, ding, ding. If this tapped for man, I'd be all about it, but it doesn't. So, is this too right? Double, double it? Yeah, sure. Look at the top three cards. You'll have me really land and put that in your hand with the rest of the money. Yeah, I'm going to take this guy. Like, every time you... This is this is a picture my dad just sent. Oh, I can't actually show it to you guys because it's not screen share. Oh, the containment breach came back? That's actually pretty good. So, what are our learn cards? Pest summoning and containment breach. Not bad. If there's a bomb in our house, I'd appreciate a heads up if it's not too much. Yeah, I mean, if I can be bothered, buddy. Field trip, I kind of liked that on the, the other thing, the thing. All right, I'll take a field trip. I mean, the learn is good, right? Like we get to put either, we get to just draw a card. So it's basically three mana, draw two, right? One is a forest that goes into play and the other is a card. My daughter told me, see, I, I can tell it's a joke already because Badger doesn't have a daughter. My daughter told me she saw a deer on the way to school. Me, how do you know it was going to school? <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> yeah okay this is pack one I feel like this is a good this is a solid pack one man whirlwind denial I like it oh shatterick sliver silver silver queen jeez I might just take that maybe we splash it we got a lot of so the problem here is field trip search for a forest uh, cultivator search for an island or a forest. These do not have land types. So it's funny that all of the, the Quandrix things so far only search for their own colors. Sammy, when you, okay, so here's Sammy, I'll, I'll, I'll sum it up for you. I'm going to, I might just take this. I think it's the best card in the pack. Is it going to cost sack or creature or pay three? <laughs> That's a plant dog. Plant dog. Coming down. All right, so obviously Quandrix has a mana theme where you want to have eight or more lands. 
Yeah, I'm just taking this thing. It's just too good. It's a 2 5 flying double striker that has like some sweet abilities. And maybe we get some things. These look so good. I, I'm like really. I'm really impressed with them. They look so cool. Okay, so Sammy. Learn says you may reveal a lesson card you own from outside the game. And in con construct in uh in competitive events or sanctioned events, that means your sideboard. Thank and you. put it into your hand. Or so if you don't have a learn card, a lesson card, you can just discard and draw a card. So you either get to learn means either you loot one time, or you can put lesson cards. Like see, this says lesson. This is a lesson. So you basically just keep these in your sideboard, and then when you learn, you can choose one of them to put in your hand. <clears throat> two two flying. Whenever another creature can control dies, put a one on counter on it. Da -da -da -da. Uh, what is this? Oh man, I ran out of time. Actually, this is not bad. Negate. Still look good. Three five for five. Actually, I don't know if this is the pick or not. I was trying to explain, and that's fine. Target creature control fights or counter a non-creature spell. This card seems great. And it's an instant. I guess it has to be because it is a counter spell. So yeah. <sighs> kind of feeling like we take channel here. And maybe we find some crazy nonsense to use with it. Like, Exile Nolly and Permanence Control draws a card. Like, obviously you don't want them to draw a card, but getting rid of anything is pretty good. A man, Yeah, we're definitely taking the channel. <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> a man walked into a hardware store and picked up a can of fly spray. Is this good for wasps? He asked the assistant to which the reply is no, it kills them. <laughs> oh, God. Fact of the day, in 1999... Hold on one second. We'll get back. Da -da -da -da. If we can get an X spell, I'm I'm actually I'm pretty excited about the channel. But I think just taking two twos for two are fine. Search your library for basic land reveal. Put it in your hand, then shuffle. You gain two life. This is actually for two mana. This is actually not bad, and it could help us cast this guy. Huh? It's got to be better than like two two for two. Yeah, sure. I'll take environmental sciences. <clears throat> Okay. After a spate of chair-related injuries, the employees of one of the units of the Seattle Police Department had to attend a 30-minute lesson on how to safely sit in a chair. <sighs> like you do. Thank you. Irk, thank you for the resub. Nature's little treasure, thank you for the resub. Didn't even see you guys. Really, really appreciate it. 2-1 for 4. Put up to one target instant or sorcery. No, okay, this pack's pretty bad for us. Pop quiz, it's literally just draw 2 for 3. It also does have good synergies. Yeah, I'll take a pop quiz. Our curve is actually pretty interesting here. Last fact, oh, second fact of the day. 1961, an aeroplane carrying... Aeroplane? <coughs> carrying... Two nuclear bombs broke up over North Carolina. Neither bomb exploded, but some of the uranium has never been found. I bet it was found by somebody. Last fact of the day, Google Assistant can make phone calls to book appointments for you. Adding in er and mm hmm sounds to appear more human. <laughs> I actually didn't know that. That's actually incredible. How many times can you say actually? Probably a lot. This art's great. Strategic planning is kind of meh. Square up is basically... I'll just take the 2-4. I mean, it's... How many creatures do we have right now? Seven? Yeah, let's just get a 2-4 up in here. Look at that. We still got a Needle Thorn. Solve the equation. Search over for an instant or sorcery reveal to put in your hand. So this is just memory. Uh, this is just uh, Merchant Scroll for three instead of two. But I'm pretty sure Merchant Scroll is also only blue cards, so... Interesting. 4-4 four, four for 5. But it's also a free card as a lesson. I'm going to take that. Is that what you meant by take the elemental? This seems good. I don't know. Like, 
like if Frost, if Pop Quiz draws you a random card and then a 4 4, like that's pretty cool. We can take Needlethorn Drake now. Oh, what up, Music Manly? <laughs> Got him. <laughs> uh, I think we're just taking the Needlethorn Drake. I wish I had Flash, but I understand. For my couple drafts so far, learn is way better than it looks, as is often the case. It's fun, but it takes up a lot of time while the players find the right stuff. Yeah, I'll just take the unblockable land. See, I wonder what the I wonder what at what times you're putting the learn spells in your main your main deck instead of your sideboard. Um, is this not this should be a lesson. Oh, that'd be cool. I'm just going to take the Quandrix Campus. Or, actually, how many five drops do we have now? One and a random one? I'm going to take... I guess I'll take Wormhole Serpent. Let me see your... Let me see your Wormhole Serpent. None of these, I don't care about any of these things. <clears throat> what do we got here? Claim the first bond. Devastating mastery. Dema Demagoth Woe Eater. That seems like a rare. <laughs> At the beginning of your upkeep, sack a creature. When you sack this, each opponent discards a card, you draw a card and gain two. Wow, that's actually pretty good. So you could just literally play it, sack itself, and it's kind of like a... It's kind of like a Doom Foretold. That's fascinating. You only need one black for it, too. Oh, so Archway Commons literally just also helps us play Shadrach's Silver Quill. I kind of like I kind of like the commons here. I want to take the commons. <clears throat> I think we're taking this. Also, if we discard it, oh yeah, we're taking this for sure. So just to be clear, this is basically a cold matter. You it deals four damage divided any way you choose. You tap two permanents, create a four four blue and red elemental, and you draw two cards. Plus we're ramping, and I also have... I, I'll pick up another Archway Commons as soon as I can, if I'm able to. Three mana. Look at the top six cards of your library. You reveal a creature and put it in your hand, put the rest on the bottom, you gain three life. That seems good for a, a lesson, for sure. Let's see Devouring Tenders. Target creature you control. Since you have to target creature, plans or you don't control with permanent... Don't. When the permanent dies, you gain two life. This is actually good, too. This is basically just ram through. I am going to take this, though, because I think it's... As a sorcery, it's kind of rough. Actually, I kind of want the Devouring Tendrils. <laughs> oh, a second negate. That's interesting. Three mana. That's actually pretty good. And we don't have a ton of removal. I, I was actually thinking of the land. We're splashing two mythics that are both off color. <laughs> uh, it's kind of funny. I'm actually going to take the playable, though. I think we need the playable. Another second whirlwind denial as well. Teachings of the Archaics. If an opponent has more cards in hand than you, draw two cards. Okay, so it's a divination if they have more. Draw three if they have at least four more cards than you. That's not bad. What is Rutha? Uh, one, four for three, return it to your owner's hand, copy and instant. You may choose new. Oh, yeah, that's fine. I'll take the teachings. That actually seems good. I'm kind of learning as I go. So, oh, another archway commons? Snake skin veil. That looks amazing. These cards look great. These are, these are, the, there was a good, um, hold on, let me see what I'm trying to say here. A great job was done on these. Let's put it that way. 
Yeah, another Archway Commons is the way to go when we're splashing. Shadrach is in Magma, magnum op magma Opus. Magma Opus. Uh, return a permanent to its owner's hand. Return a permanent from your graveyard to your hand. So this can get back Shadrachs, but it can't get back Opus. So that's worth noting for the one we have. I think we can just take Tangle Trap for the sideboard. Oh, we can take another Elemental Summoning. But we don't actually have a ton of... Weather the Storm. Gain three life, and it has Storm. Another field trip actually is not bad. Sorry, lose all abilities becomes your choice of a blue frog with base power one or a blue octopus with base power four four. So you're either making a frog or an octopus. This art's also great with the frog and the octopus. Another wormhole. Add a man of any color. Sacrifice a draw card. I think this is actually probably good for us. Exile tap creature? Sure, I'll take an expel. Why not? So frog and an octopus walk into a bar. All right. <clears throat> I'll take a Bayou Groff. Two one for two. Enters battle from your search for basically under put on top. Actually, I mean I don't hate that as much as I should because we do have. We're probably playing at least one. Uh, swamp. We're playing one of every land basically. So that's the thing. <clears throat> two one with flash sacrifice your opponent gets negative one negative zero for sure all right five colors first draft yeah we we're we know how to do it gain two life then discard two if you do draw three target against trample sure i don't care about any of these all right. Where in Mythics you collected that exceeded the 4x collection limit were converted to gems? What? Um, what rare and Mythic do I have already? What? I'm trying to figure out what kind of what rare or mythic I would have had that I got gems for. There's no way that channel channel wasn't available on here. What? I'm like pretty confused by that. Oh, they give it to you for channel? Oh, because it's a mythic that you can't actually play? Okay. I mean, that makes sense, I guess. It's not ideal, but I guess it makes sense. All right, so our lessons are like... I'm also taking channel out. How many lands is this? Do we need more playables? Oh, 17 lands. We need two more playables from the sideboard? <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, then. Maybe it's just a little frog. Two one flash frog. Uh, actually, how many spined? I can play another two four. I think that's fine. Lesson, lesson. Lesson, lesson everywhere. Lesson, lesson have no air. Listen, listen in the free. Listen, but to eat. That's a song I just made up. I listen. Where X is the number of lands you control. This could be fine. We actually don't have that high of a curve. This is probably going to be a three drop. I can't imagine us playing that on something that's not. Here's a shiny nickel for you. 
Yeah, I'll just try the ley line invocation. Okay. What's our mana base? One plains, one swamp, one mountain. I like that. Five, five. So we actually have, this is, all three of these produce any color. Yeah, all right. Boy, this is a deck, all right. I have no idea what we're doing. Land, land, two, two, we can cycle this. You know what? Sure. We're on the draw. Oh, look at this backdrop. My my deck is on a, on a carpet. We didn't change our lands again. I guess we wanted Strixhaven lands. That's fine. It's a squirrel. Touch on the... This is best of three. I, I do not play best of one because I think it's a trash format. I went 112. How is that even possible? Oh my god, antibody. Okay, now we're talking. No attacks. Well, that turns on two of our cards. It's all right. All right. <clears throat> I don't know what's going on here. I guess we're playing the mirror match. What does this guy do? Draw a card, discard, just a looter. Man, remember when looters were free and now it's like, I gotta pay two to loot? Also, this guy looks real creepy. Don't care about that. Would like a land here, but you know, what are you gonna do? Well, one land gets us this guy. Two to loot in this economy? Yeah, that's what I'm saying, bud. That's what I'm saying, man. pretty fine. All right. Where's my lands at, man? This is really sad. I guess we could cycle this. I really don't want to, though. Yeah, I mean, I don't have to do it right now, and I can also play Barry in the books if they, if they come at me. Any one land lets us play both of these guys, which both draws cards, so that's pretty cool. What does this guy do? When enters battlefield, create a zero zero, put a one one counter each fractal you control. So in multiples, that guy's pretty good. It's just a two two makes a one one. Interesting. That's a good one. All right. I'm playing this guy just because I want the lander right now. 
Let's get a forest So if we draw one, if we draw a black or a white, we can play Shadrix. If we draw enough lands, we can play Mag Magma Opus. Oh, getting closer. So this is doing put a land from your hand on the battlefield. Sure, draw a card if you control it. Jesus, that's actually pretty decent. So they can just double block here and then we get to trade with one. And I don't really want to put either of those back. I think we're just going to play Gnarled Professor here. So you took all five pamphlets? Yeah, I was like, I don't know what school to go to. Target creature gets reach. So it's like, so it gets plus three. This is actually a great trick. Two plus two, plus, so it gets plus three, plus three in reach. And one of the counters stays. Jeez. Um... The question is getting rid of it forever. Yeah, I think we just want to get rid of it forever. Forever. Yeah, that's fine. I mean, the alternative is playing Gnarl Professor, but then they just get to keep a 2-2. Like, why let them keep a 2-2 and lose our own 2-2? Okay, so hold on. Let me see what we got here. I know that guy. Room a book counter from it. Whenever you can. Yeah, sure, that's fine. Six mana. Make a 6-6. Six, six. Why, why do that now? You have reach as well. Um, <sighs> two more mana for this. Thank you. Yeah, I'm just going to attack here. That's fine if you want to block. Hey, Saru, thank you for the resub, buddy. Ophalo, thank you for the bits, my dude. No, no. One, two, three, four. Oh, Cyborg Huey with the resub. Thank you, guys. Really appreciate it. What? Wait, what? Yeah, auto pay. <laughs> the man is in the pool, man. It's not auto paying. I paid. I did the paying. Um, oh, search for basic land port. We're gonna put it in your hand for two. Um, yeah, let's do that. Oh, I have control, and that's why I'm a. I'm actually a, a big dumb dumb. Um, yeah, it's fine. Okay, now we're basically doing it. We can play Shadrix next turn, and then if we draw land, we can play Magma Opus. It's getting hot in here, boys. Our deck is exciting. So right now we have like rare, 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 uncommon, uncommon. Also, they have four lands. We have seven. So one more land. This becomes a four, four. Okie dokie. This is what living the dream feels like, I think. Okay, that guy's good. There's a land. <laughs> okay. Well. Hmm. 
create a 4-4 four, four, blue and red elemental. Yeah, we're just doing that. I mean, this is great and all, but they're not even close to... Uh, two permanents to tap. Those two. Distribute damage. Uh, obviously like this. Dude, stop roping me when I'm trying to figure out the friggin' 10 modes on Magma Opus. Come on, dude. <laughs> it's actually insane. Oh, what a card. What a card. Do it faster. You're not doing it fast enough. It's all right. Ooh. I'm actually surprised we're still playing. I mean, this seems like a... I feel like a concession is in the air, you know? Uh... Sure. Six. So we got what? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this is six. If we draw a three mana spell, we can this one. Is this good? Okay. They're making the best of it. Okay, um, that's pretty good, I guess. Play our land. I don't think we need to show them this if we don't have to. I'm gonna just play 9-9. Nine, nine. Get in there. It's all right. They're just going to leave these guys and like... Um... Yeah. Alright, they're at one. <laughs> I, think we, I think we got it. Is there a danger to attack with everything? Okay. I suppose not. Lightning Bolt for 24 would actually do it. It's all right. All right. I don't actually feel like we could use anything here. Gotta build me a new elf deck now. Oh, what up, Josh? Ravnica part 10? Uh, I think you mean Cons of Tarkir part 7. <laughs> Amateur. Channel with no Eldrazi. This ain't your usual. I know, buddy. I don't know what to tell you. I draft... Apparently, I, I, I draft regular draft formats like I draft cubes. Uh, I'll keep this hand.
I did not know I put this in the deck. Interesting. I guess at worst it's a 5-4, or you can sack something, something crappy. You got it. Yeah, I'll pay for that thing. I just want to keep memory laps up. If they just want to loot here or like not put anything on the board, that's fine. But I don't think Neil Thorn Drake is really going to be uh, game breaking for us. I don't know hit. Getting close to this Shadrix. We can play this on six because of Hall of Oracles, which is pretty nice. Target your counter target non creature spell. So we have actually two counter spells in hand. So we're going to play Neil Thorn Drake next turn. We'll just keep the two counter spells up, or one counter spell up, I guess. It's all right. Get him, Groff. What is it? Okay, so whenever you cast an I put a book counter. A book counter from add mana. Roof three. To, yeah, sure. I don't care about that. That's just kind of clunky. So if we draw a white or a black, we can play Shadrix. Shad Shadrix? Shadrix? God, these look so cool. I'm just a really big fan of these. Gene Shallots? Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's cool. What is this here? Put it from your grave on the top of your line. Third from the top. Sure. It's basically, uh, a Palaka Worm that, that keeps keeps rolling. Hold on one second. Okay. We just got approved for a house that we applied for. So that's like super exciting. <laughs> oh man, that's awesome. Super exciting. Um, that's awesome. Wow. Now we don't have to find a house. It's all right. All right. Let's play this. Let's play this fat idiot. Could have actually played this tap their guy down. Wasn't really focusing too much on that turn because, again, it's kind of exciting. When can y'all come visit? As soon as COVID's over. Let's do it. Oh, there's a white mana boy. So let's just get in there and do a big, big attacks. Also, we have two counter spells in case they have any shenanigans. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think we just wait till next turn because then we can actually. One approval buck. Carwood, well, thank you so much, buddy. Appreciate it, my dude. Because next turn we can actually uh, keep up counter spells. And also play our Silver Quill. Plus, if this guy's in play, then this ability, when it triggers, can put counters on both these guys. Is it each other? Each creature they control. Oh, that's pretty good.
What does this do? I don't know what this card does. Get out of here. No, I don't know what the card does. <laughs> Tap two creatures and untap. Shh, to draw two cards and discard a card. Mm, I don't like that. Man, too bad we didn't have this up, right? Oh, actually it only is a sorcery, so you can't just like play your card. Okay, well, that's a thing, all right. All right, so... I'm gonna... What, do they have one card? I'm gonna give them a card. And put counters on my guys. Are you sure? Yes. I mean, you either take nine or you block with your, with your, that, that's actually fine with me. Well, yeah, we, that's how we planned it. <laughs> we didn't play this guy until we had the lapse mana. So if they do any kind of shenanigans, not only can they not replay it. Seems good. Aren't they dead if we just get, if we give, like, this is, if we put counters on our guys and give them a, this is, this is just the game, right? Because they have two mana, we counter whatever they do. We put counters on our guys, give them another card, they go to ten. This is eight and this is four. Why did you have them draw? So, uh, at the beginning of combat in your turn, you may choose two. Each mode must target a different player. So, yeah, we have to... Uh, same modes. Yes. I mean, putting counters on all of your all of your creatures. Usually, if this guy has double strike, it's it's each other creature. But I'm not sure what they could have here. But I have memory lapse, so I'm gonna win with a mystical archive card. ML is OPFL. ML memory lapse. Okay, got it, got it. Utter Pellin, have a good, uh, have a good EDH, have a good commander, buddy. So why make a treasure and then just die? Did they forget this had double strike? I don't know what that, I don't know that that was weird. You guys got a house yet? We literally just got approved like five minutes ago. Yeah, it's super exciting. 
Yeah, I literally just had to pause my game for like two seconds. Look at that. Nothing even happened. I can close these rental listings now. Wow, that feels good. It's all right. Why does this song stuck in my head? Why is any song stuck in my head? Nobody knows. Um, I actually kind of like this because of letter acceptance. I think this hand's decent. This is also draw two. Sure, we can keep this. That actually helps us. That's a land. It lets us play pretty much anything in our deck. Oh, dang it. You have to roll a forest or an island, huh? I mean, might as well play it, right? We have nothing else to play. We can't play this with any other land, so. Frank, what is song? <laughs> How is Babby formed? Yeah, dude, I have like I have like three tabs open with uh, a bunch of different. Um... That guy seems good. Jeez, um, with a bunch of different. Uh, like house, like house pages, basically like rental house pages and things. So it's nice to be able to just finally close them all. <sighs> what a brackish trudge. That's a fungus beast. Is Strixhaven available on MTG? I believe so. I believe it is. For new sets and things, I like to build my collection on Arena because I feel like that's where I play more modern formats. This card seems really good. Uh, we're renting a house in Colorado, yes. Mountain. So what is this? Oh, wow. This is the good one, huh? That card's good. Um, I mean, next turn, we can't play Shadrix without this. So let's just play this. And then next turn, we can... Shadrix. Okay, not bad. I kind of want to keep memory lapse up, so I'm just going to play this guy. You do have Menace. It's pretty good. This card seems great, and I'm actually thinking, if you guys haven't checked out my article on Cool Stuff this week... I'm actually thinking of replacing Woe Strider with Sedgemore Witch in my cube because I think Menace and the ability to make multiple 1-1s one is just better. Jelly of the Month Club is where it's at. Arena doesn't have modern. I don't think I want to choose any. Actually, how many cards do they have? A million. I kind of want to. I kind of want to make an ink moth for myself, an ink moth nexus. There's only one man who would. Oh, it's not. It doesn't. I don't think. I don't think the quote is the raspberry. It's raspberry.
It's all right. Resolve that. I kind of just want to pop this back on top. Oh, interesting. It is the raspberry. Um... Is there a one mana trick? Maybe. Are we going to get blown out here? Maybe. I'm sorry, what is that? X the amount of life you gained this turn. How much did they gain? Oh, they gained two, so plus two, plus two. But then they gained one from the pest as well. Okay. Well, uh, if you battle for they have a one one, they're gonna draw that big fat daddy. They do have more cards than us, so we can draw two. Do we have enough mana to make a four four? One, two, three, four, five. We do. Thank you. Five, five for five. Whenever you cast a spell, you gain a life. Sure. You just have a lot of things. It's not an artifact or enchantment, right? Just a five, five for five. That's good. One, two, three, four, five. Old Man Silver, thank you for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. I really appreciate it, my dude. Oh, that's good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So once I cast this, it will count for having more cards, right? Because I have one card in hand. Yeah, sweet. Okay, cool. Return a permanent to its owner's hand. Oh, that's really good. And we can get our Shadrix back. Oh, that's 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 pretty good. Um oh no. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, we have plenty of mana. Uh don't do that. Just go one, two, three. Uh, four. Uh, target, return a permanent to his owner's hand. This guy. Get Shadrick's back. That seems good, right? We've reached the stage of standard where everyone, where I'm overwhelmed by the number of cards and bored because everyone still plays the same 20. That is literally my biggest issue with standard is that there are maybe like four decks 
And out of like the, you know, 1600 cards that are legal and standard, 400 of them get played. How much does it cost to draw a card? Two, huh? I mean, I'll trade with either of these guys. Totally fine. I'm actually going to play this because if we end up drawing something like uh, the counter spell, unless they play three or bounce a card or fight, uh, I'd like to be able to cast it. And our mana base is excellent right now. Yeah, this card seems really good. Oh, alrighty then. Well, um, what are we keeping up here? This is the hall, right? No, I'm going to use that. Cancel. Uh, that colorless. Come on, one time, one time, one time. Dang it. Brutal. That also seems good. Exiling creature, exile instant or sorcerer from the graveyard, and then learn. Yeah, that seems good too. And this has been a good game. This has been a lot of back and forth here. I actually have no idea how how it's going to end. I feel like they're a little ahead. <laughs> I mean, if we can draw Magma Opus, I think we'd uh, probably win. Uh, that's a, that's, we're also drawing a lot of cards. We only have we've drawn we have twenty five cards. Man, that's pretty good. Not as good. Does it have trample? Of course it does. Why wouldn't it? Well, it's gonna, that guy's going to be big. Five here, they make a big fat idiot. And I got three cards, I'm sure there's gonna be another blowout. Yep, never fails.
It's all right. All right. <laughs> Where were you? All right, we're going to go to the next game. Actually, I mean, it's funny because we can deal... Yep. Have you watched Paul recently? I don't think I've watched Paul in my life. I don't even know what that is. When are we going to come down? When are we going to... Kind of like expel against them. I think we have enough fixing. I think we take out this apprentice, put an expel. Or destroy preacher power for greater. Both of these seem good. Take out burying books. I'm gonna add one more planes because he just added two white cards. I'm also gonna fix my mana base. One, two. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One swamp. Get out of here. One mountain. Get out of here. And then five forestos. Done. Uh... I'm gonna keep this. We're on the, we're on the. I guess we're on the play, but has to draw. What? I don't understand. Do I have things I can do? Oh yeah, we're so good at this game. What are we getting here? Six mana, six cards. I think it's actually just environmental science. It lets us play trickster next turn and environmental. I, and I just kind of want the, I just kind of want the fixing land. Cause like if we can get a, a white here, it's really good. And that's Thank you. really good. Brett with the resub. Exile with Tappy Boy. Just end the turn here. Thank you for the resub, Brett. Because Brett, we just got we got the house that we uh, applied for. So, do you want to target? Wait, why wouldn't I? Yeah, I'll pay my three, and then they can snake skin veil. Because why wouldn't you have that? And then we're gonna feel real dumb because we took three, and then we're gonna take four, five, six, so four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So we're gonna go to eleven here. Okay. Buddha style. I hope you're doing well, buddy. Uh, yeah. Oh, it did not work that way. Oh, and they didn't do anything else. Okay, cool. I'm gonna play this guy because this just gets better the longer we wait. So
Hmm. How many drafts are you done? This is literally my first draft. L literally my first draft. Seven seven seems good. I'm sure they'll have removal for it, but that's okay. And there you go. There you go. Ding, 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 ding. Unfortunate, we have no permanence in our graveyard. So we'll just play this little guy. Is it instant or sorcery? Sorcery? Sure. Thank you. Okay. Got it. Hey man, keep on keeping on. Hey man, I like your hair. What up, Kellett? Good seeing you, buddy. We have a good time. Uh one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I like that. I mean, getting rid of this forever is pretty good. I mean, this isn't the greatest creature to get back, but it's still, it invalidates their removal and their lesson, so. Plus we have a 4-4 four, four now. Well, that guy's obnoxious, but. Oh, we can just double. Yeah, these are some of the best common dual lands that have been printed in maybe ever. Like, the ability to scry one is so much better than randomly gaining a life. Oh, we should have played this first. I'm an actual dum dum. I mean, on the bright side, like, now we have a red from, from Magna, Magna Opus.
So they have one card in hand, huh? I'll take it. Oh, I like that. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Sure. Wow. Wow, memory lapsing that was bananas. Does it make it worth power? Or was it casting cost? Oh wow, that's really, that was insane. That was, that was boof. That was a big boof. So four, five, six, seven, eight. Better do it now. They didn't do it now? Hmm. Destroy an artifact that doesn't do anything. Create a blue elemental that doesn't do anything. So what does this do exactly? Create four one ones. One, two, three, four, one, two, one, two, three, four. This has, been, this has been a hell of a game, man. How much time do they have? 15 and we have 16? All right, so not, not really close, but good Lord, this is taking a while. And we still have another game if I win. <laughs> so, uh, the best memory lapse of all time since Strixhaven released. Yeah, that's probably true. That was a good one. They sack a 5-3 a and don't get to recast their spell. 
<laughs> oh my god. Jesus. Two of those, huh? It's a really good common. <laughs> wow, two of those too, huh? This format seems great. That's cool. That that was a good that was a good draw there. Um I don't really feel like I'm benefiting by attacking here. I really hope they just forgot this has reach, because that would be super cool. Oh, they did. That was fantastic. Good for us. Oh, man. Never going to do that again. Now our attacks are better. A lot of lands. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 lands, huh? Plenty like me to be found. Wait, did I just miss did I just miss align those and kill the two one ones that are the two two? I definitely would have killed the two two. I think I just I was I was reading a thing over here. This card has been quite obnoxious. Ideally, we draw Magnum Opus, and then we put a counter on our Squirrel, and then we just win the game. Okay, that's not it. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Thirteen lands, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Thirteen, yeah. There you go. Correct play. Alright, let's not draw land here because otherwise we're dead. Magma, magma Opus one time, dude. Fucking land. Jesus. 14th land. Significantly more likely. Sounds good. Okay, well, unfortunately our deck, just thought of watching go to the five color deck, yes, yes I did. That's right. Oh, uh, snap keep. Turn two commons, turn three letter of acceptance. Or turn two scurred colony. Don't be scurred. What does this thing do? Attacking spirits get plus one plus oh. Okay, well. 
I'm just gonna play this guy here, actually. Because next turn we'll have two so we can play Letter into Forest, which is nice. Oh, what up, Dealey Coker? What up, my dude? Welcome back. I appreciate you, buddy. We could have kept up Quandrix Apprentice as well, but... I'm good. One, two, three, four, five, six. Thank you. Oh, Brett with the gifted sub to Buddha style. Oh, Buddha 91, did we just play? Because your deck was insane. Your deck was very, very good. Let's get in there with this crocodile. Is it a crocodile? It literally is a crocodile. Love it. Oh my God, Brett! Was, Brett, I think you meant to do it to to Buddha ninety one, and then you accidentally did it to Buddha style. So I just get, I just get those double, double. Uh, oh, this is not the card I thought it was. I'm stupid. So I, got, I just got the the double gifted sub perk. <laughs> oh, when are you cast the two two? This core shaman. Okay, it looked like it was flying. It's just a two two first striker. Sure. Man, I kept this up because I was like, this is the card that counters the non-creature spell. It's not one, two, three, four, five, six. How big does this guy get? It gets plus one, plus O. Oh. Yeah, I don't care about that. And we get to find a land. Oh, that's a good one too. And now we're one mana away from Opusing. This is it. This is a dream lived. I'm not going to attack with this guy because really I don't need to trade when this guy's just going to be a 4 4 later. All of this is fine. What is this? When you cast a spell, copy. When you cast a spell, copy free control planes or describe and draw a card. Sure. I don't. Did they control a shaman, warlock, or wizard? No. So they just drew one. And then they played a shaman after. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Dang it. But none of these dudes fly. But this guy got reach. Okay. So block here, and then you double block, maybe? Yeah, seems fine. Let me get two free. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Just making sure we didn't have an eighth mana. <clears throat> Oh, okay, cool. We don't even get to play our Magma Opus. Uh, I don't really see anything that we can... I mean, I mean, like, this guy actually might be decent here. How do you feel the archive cards contribute to the feel of this format since there's... I actually like them a lot. But I actually have no idea if that has to do with their limited applications whatsoever. I like them a lot as cards. I don't actually know. I don't know. Like, Memory Lapse has been really good for us. Um, 
that being said, I don't know overall how they're going to affect the format, if that makes sense, you know? We could even play this guy now that we have a, a deck that's entirely, uh, you know, you know what I'm saying. I think our deck is fine. Having a bunch of two fours here. hand is a snapperino. What does this do? Exile illustrious historian from your graveyard. Created. That's actually great. That's actually really good. 2-1 for 2 that just makes a 3-2 later in the game for no cost. That's actually great too. So we can play Needlethorn Drake and then we can play Field Trip. Or letter of acceptance. Shut up and take my money. Oh, Neon Tokyo Rain. This deck is not fine abort. Wait, what? I, you don't think our deck is good? Are you? How are you going to be like this? How are you going to be like this? I'm going to just play this. I don't think we care about the two damage. I think I'd rather just get that land down. And next turn we can play a letter or field trip. Probably field trip. Okay, so now they got a little bit of an army here. The problem is, actually we have Letter and Hall. Yeah, I'm just gonna play this, we'll take four and then we'll just play Shadrix next turn. Cause then we also have Devouring Tendrils into Give Shadrix a Counter. What does this guy do? Whenever one of our cards leave the graveyard, scry one. Sure. All right, fingers crossed. Uh, I don't really want to choose two here. Definitely not blocking that. No, I'm JK. Wow, that's real mature, buddy. Real mature. Like any trick kills us with this uh, with this attack. Okay, sure. You're at twenty, and I have one two five flyer, but all right. It's good times. Our deck is sweet, I guess. Thank you guys for watching this first Strixhaven draft i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope you guys had a good time hope you'll come back i hope you'll subscribe and follow on twitch and on youtube i hope you'll support the channel in every way you can and i hope you guys had a good time thank you guys for watching i'll see you next time